So what is the dojo? We review healthier options of delicious foods that promise to chop the preservatives and kick that processed crap out of here. Will these brands stand up to their promise? Find out here at the dojo. So our first ever review will be on one of the most favorite things that we both like to eat. Peanut yeah, butter. This bad boy right here. Got me through a lot of tough times, man. You know what bothers me, man? What's that? People who weigh 120 pounds that review food. <laughs> like, I honestly, I cannot take you seriously if you I'm weigh- I'm not 120 uh, pounds, by the way. You, you know, yeah, I used to weigh 330 pounds. So I was 100 pounds overweight. So I've, so I've done my research. I know what good food is and what bad food is. So what are, we, what are the things we're gonna look at first? So I personally don't think peanut butter is that unhealthy. But, neither do I, but there are healthier options to this, I guess. So the first one, okay, <laughs> ingredients here. <laughs> it's selected roasted peanuts, which is good. That's not bad, selected. I wonder what, how they're selecting. They have somebody just like walk down the aisle, like, I like that peanut. Yeah, this peanut's good, I let's do that put job. this here. This one goes in the, the no-name brand. I don't know, that's probably how they do we it. Should, we should try to volunteer there. Let's see. <laughs> Soybean oil. Soybean oil, okay. Soybean oil. Okay. Corn maltodextrin. Maldection is a polysaturide that is used as a food additive. So that's why peanut butter is not good. <laughs> okay, so it's, it's basically an additive to make it have longer shelf life. Uh, sugar, hydrogenated vegetable oil, cotton seed, and rape seed. Rape, rape seed? seed? What the hell's a rape? I don't know, rape seed. A rape seed, also known as rape. <laughs> Did you, know you guys know you're eating rape seed, man? Rape seed is canola? Canola is rape seed. Canola oil is rape oil. Okay, so we found these three bad boys here. Can you introduce those? Well, fat so. Just on the name alone, I would actually just purchase this without even yeah. not knowing I had anything no, about I the product. I had no clue about this, but when I saw the name, I'm like, yeah, that, we gotta yeah, try that. Yeah, the, the name is everything. Like, fat so. Made me put my hand up like, yep, yeah, that's Fatso, me. Yeah. yep, that's talking my name. Next one. Next one we got nuts and more. Okay, cool, I dig that. Nuts dark, and more. We got the dark chocolate. The reason why nuts and more is popular is because they have protein in their mix. Buff bake? Buff bake. Buff that's, bake. That's how I feel when that's I it, make my it, protein baby. pancake that's son. Their baby mm, buff bake. And brownies. This oh, yeah. one has pro is a protein Sorry, spread as well. Excited to eat. Yeah. <laughs> Relax. I know, bro. man. I'm here Relax. to eat, bro. I'm here to eat. This is why you asked me to do Gear it. Gear down, big rig. So What's first, C's? First, we're gonna start it off with smell because half the taste is in the smell. Yeah. Start off with fatso. Smell it. You gotta turn it, you know, let the, the aromatics just. What do you think? It smells like I'm walking through a field of vanilla. It actually smells glorious. What is wrong with Use the waffling technique. Waffle. Waffle it into your Oh, nose. there it is. There you go, there see? Oh, you are a sensei. Ah, trust me, man. You can really smell the, the flax in there. Yep, yep. Getting a, a little hint of that little avocado in there. <laughs> I like it. I'm interested. I'm again. interested. Smell this bad boy. I'm excited to smell this one. I love cacao in the morning. Fantastic. That smells good, eh? That smells so good. Oh, man. That smells... Nutty and chocolatey. I just, just, just want to smear it all over my body. You know, when, just, you, know, you know when you're sick and your mom just rubs the Vicks? I just want to put it on top of my mouth. It just, just makes me feel better every night. I give that, uh, that five out of five. That's a, that, that is definitely a five out of five on smell. Clear your palate. This one, it smells more like a, a dark chocolate. Yeah. And it smells more natural for some reason than the other one. Let's check the consistency of this. Now, okay. when it comes to peanut butter, I like it smooth. Uh, smooth. Right? Yeah. Like, it, like it, it's, it's, it's soft in the palate, you know? Yeah. This to me is a little too watery. Yeah, that looks like... Now, I don't know if we were supposed to refrigerate this or this is how it comes, but... I don't think you refrigerate peanut butter. No? No. You know what? This could be a good dip if you think about it. Oh yeah, that's right? true. That's true. All right, that's so true. You're just ooh, it's a little oh. gummy in there. Look, do you see oh, that? Oh, oh, oh. That means it's good. There's oh. like there's like oh, it's sustenance chunky. in there, right? There's, yeah, there's some. It has body. It has body in there. Oh, yeah, the other yeah. one is way smooth. This oh, one hold has on, like. Hold on, let me get more. So I guess next is taste. Yeah. yeah so yeah. look at that. It's more like 
What's this consistency, would you say? Like pasty? Yeah, yeah, i say it's more peanut buttery yeah. than the other one. It's definitely more thick and peanut, like your traditional peanut butter. Yeah. A little bit, actually, a little bit more thicker than your peanut butter, your regular peanut butter than the smooth one. Um, I'm excited because there's, it, it looks like there's little hints of stuff in there. Okay, <laughs> all right. I guess we're going to step three and going for taste. <laughs> Get in there. Let's do it. This is gross, by the way, that we're double dipping our spoon. That's fine. <laughs> I trust hey, you. Hey, you know what? No one else can eat it. <laughs> I mean, it's, it seems a lot smoother than this one, not as grainy, yeah. but it is a little watery as well. Again, maybe because we got to mix it a little more. Oh, you know what I do? I, I When I get something like this, I just like, I mix it. Yeah, you mix it. Time. It's probably just a lot of the oils and dust. Mix it one let me, time. Let me get a good mix right there. Ooh, that was, see, there you go. Yeah, so I mean, yeah. the consistency is not too bad. It does seem pretty smooth. I like it. It's almost like, it's like a shiny coat. Yes, yes. So now it's a taste test? Yes, it is. All right. This, this reminds me of, um, you know, Winnie the Pooh when he eats the honey? He eats the honey? Yeah. All right, let's see. I always this. wanted to eat honey like that. All right, don't tell me you're... Surprisingly more sweet than I thought it would be. I like, I like the seeds in there. I'm liking it. I like. I'm liking it. It's almost you like. You know, it, it wasn't as watery as I thought it'd be. Yeah, and it's not. It doesn't taste as oily, like and messy. It, and the flax seed does add some texture to it, so it feels like it, it, you're you're almost eating like the crunchy peanut butter. Yeah, I like it. You wanna try the next one. I re I really like this actually. Not bad, fat so not bad. It's gluten free, high protein spread. So this is a protein peanut butter. Oh, that's why. So they're they're probably a, the it probably has a, the, the protein in it. Yeah, exactly. That's what's making it a little grainy. The sugars are a little higher on this one, as you can tell. It's a lot tastier. I the think sugar's about had, four grams. We've had three so far. <laughs> four grams of sugar. <laughs> so we just had twelve grams of sugar. <laughs> but it's natural sugar. Natural sugar. So one could argue it's a little bit better. But for me, that the, it's not a make it or break it. I'm not eating this all the time, although I probably would because that's pretty damn good. Yeah, I mean, if, <laughs> if you were dieting and you were trying to watch out for your sugars and stuff like that, probably not the best option for you. But taste-wise, if you're trying to gain weight and you need extra protein, that is delicious. I would eat that after a workout, 100%. I, I would eat that when I wake up in the morning. In the morning before, <laughs> before, before to brush my teeth. Before like, I go to bed. I would use that to brush my teeth. <laughs> you know, it's like a packaging that makes you want to eat it. Yes. All right, I guess we're going in. When you put your spoon in here, it doesn't stop you from going in. Yeah, it's, it's it's just just it just through. invites you right in. Right? It, it kind of sucks you in almost. It's like quicksand. A little dry for me. It's a bit more drier. Definitely a bit more drier than Nuts and More and this one. I don't find it as sweet. I don't as, find it as sweet I, I think this is the least sweet for me. Yeah, yeah it, I that agree. Does that make sense? I Does this agree. even have sugar? Oh, it has zero sugar, man. That's probably why. Oh no, I'm lying. Zero sugar, alcohol, it has four grams of sugar. Okay, I take it back. Out of five, what do you give the taste? Ah, uh, taste, I gotta give it a two. Really? Yeah. This is interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not a huge fan. I think because it, it was a little too dry for me, I, I like my like smoother and like like velvety on my tongue, you know? Whereas this yeah. kind of took the saliva right out of my mouth. Yeah, I feel really you dry. Know, like it's I, like I, cement. Like, yeah, All right, I, need, yeah. <laughs> I need water. Fatso, ooh, $10.99 for that. $10.99 for Fatso, that is a fat ass price. <laughs> fatso comes with baggage, son, holy. And how that's much a, is the crap? That's a sumo 99. price. And this is usually $5.99 at the grocery store. All right, for this one on Amazon is $4.67. Oh, it was close, I said $4.99. Holy. <laughs> I know my peanut butter. Jesus. So the price of this one, this one is $13.59. Thirteen fifty nine. Oh my God, man! What was the price of this? This one was fifteen ninety nine. Sorry, buff, your last. Final thoughts. Just based on this, what would your number one gym buddy be? I would have to go with nuts and more. Nuts and more. Yeah, it's the, the I... chocolatey, the, the texture. So what? It's a little higher in sugar. It's okay. I'll just do a little more cardio. <laughs> but uh, I'd have to say this would be my favorite one. Now my second favorite, which is not too too far behind, gotta go with Fatso. 
So you were, this is very close together? They're very close together. I, I, I would choose this just because it's higher in protein and it has that chocolatey taste, but I do like this because of its texture and, and, and the chia seeds that they put in there. It actually tastes great. Okay. My what? least favorite would be the Buff Bake. I like it. The guys at Buff Bake, great product, but yeah, compared to these two, my gym buddy is this one. My overall favorite was actually this one as well, but I do like this. I would eat this on a regular basis, morning, whatever. I could put this in a protein shake. Yeah. I would eat that with, you know, um, the rice cakes. I would eat any of these with rice cakes. Yeah. So my top two are definitely these two. Go try it for yourself. Let us know what you think. I'm Caesar. I'm Carlo. Thanks for joining the dojo.